Auzubillahimineşşeytanirracim, Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Rabbi şahli sadri ve yesirli amri ve alel uddetem min lisani yefkahu kavli Rabbi habli minas salihi rabbana hablana min azvacina ve zuriyatina kuratul ayin ve zelna lil mutakina imama amma ba'd. Dear friends, Aslamu alaikum. As you are already knowing the fact that previously we have been delivering few lectures concerning the other two parts of speech that is noun and pronoun. And today we're gonna talk, we're gonna demonstrate something about another part of speech, and that's you know adjective. So today our topic is adjective. This word is also self-explanatory. Now see, adjective. It means that it's telling something more about you know noun or pronoun, or we can say it's a word which is qualifying or modifying a noun or a pronoun. Also, we can say that it's adding something to the meaning of you know noun or pronoun. In Urdu, this can be translated as sifat. But uh, the problem in understanding is that in Urdu, we are always, or in English as well, we are taking it in always in positive connotations. That is, you know, some quality. But we are taking the quality in positive connotation. The quality can be sometimes negative as well. Now, see, suppose I am writing a sentence over here like this. This is my red shirt this is my red shirt now see this is the syntactical structure of this very sentence I mean to say this is the sensical coherence or continuity of words developing a you know fantastic and meaningful sentence now we have to see which part belongs to which which word belongs to which part of speech since we are talking something about adjective, so adjective is you know something uh, which is which is added to the noun or pronoun, or uh, we can say it's some quality also. Now see, this is the sentence, and we have to see which word it, uh, which word belongs to which part of speech. Now see, this is this okay is my red and shirt. What is this? This is, you know, pronoun. It's pronoun. And we have previously discussed about it. It's pronoun. Which pronoun it is? It is actually a demonstrative pronoun. It is, what I mean to say it is? It is demonstrative pronoun. That we have, you know, previously talked about and this word what is this this word is you know its verb its verb okay which verb it's it's actually you know auxiliary verb we call it also helping verb yet we are not you know talked about the verbs initially uh, inshallah in the coming days we'll be discussing also this very part of speech then we'll be able to have the comprehensive and holistic understanding of the verb then we'll be also able to categorize the verbs into different categories okay now see this is the category of verb that is auxiliary verb or we can say it as helping verb as well now see this is my this is also pronoun and which pronoun it is it is actually first person possessive pronoun it is you know it's first person was this seal pronoun or we can say it is first person genitive pronoun okay this we have discussed previously so there's no need to discuss recapitulate the things up once again because it's just consuming our time now see this is another word this is shirt and it's now it's now it's now 
this now. It's actually, you know, common noun, it's, it is common noun. It is common noun, that we have discussed previously. It's common. Now we have to see this word, which word it actually is. Now see, what is adjective? adjective? Adjective is a word which is adding something to the noun, or we can say which is qualifying or modifying the noun. In layman's terms, we can say that it is adding something to the noun. So, see, the relationship of this very word, this word, red, now we have to see to which word it is having connection, linkage, and, you know, the conformity and, you know, coherence and, you know, uh, all these, you know, similarities. Now, see, this word, red. So this word it indicates that it's having some sort of relation with this shirt. Since shirt itself is noun, now we have to clarify this very thing. Since shirt is noun, since shirt is noun, shirt is noun, and this word red, it is you know we can say it is showing showing some sort of supplementary help strength to this very word. It's adding the quality of coloration to this very word. This word red is adding the quality of coloration to this very word. And this word since is now, so this word will be categorized as adjective. Because it is adding something. It's adding something to the meaning of this very now. It's modifying this very now. It's qualifying this very now. It is, it is giving some sort of supplementary stance to this in, in terms of coloration to this very word. So it's giving the quality of coloration to this word. So it is, you know, adding the quality of, uh, you know, coloration to this very word. And this word, since is noun, so it will be categorized as adjective. Initially, we have to say uh, to, which, to which word this word is having linkage, connectivity, coherence and understanding the actual concept. Now see, this this, this and red, red is not having any sort of conformity. Okay? So similarly, this red is not having any sort of, you know, connectivity in, in the meaning to this very word. Also, this is not also having linkage with this very word. Okay, it is you know quite clear for here that this word is having some sort of bondage, some sort of linking, some some sort of you know connectivity to this very word. Okay, so it is adding the quality of it's adding the quality of coloration to this very word. Okay, to this very word, and this word is noun, so it is adding something. So it is adding something, adding it's adding something to this very noun, or we can say it's qualifying this very word, it's modifying this very word, it's adding something, some meaning to this very word, it's adding some quality to this very word. Okay. So this is the sentence. So this is, you know, pronoun and it's demonstrative pronoun, this verb and it is, you know, auxiliary or helping verb and this is also pronoun but it is first person possessive pronoun. And this is noun, that's common noun, and this is adjective because it is adding or qualifying or modifying or adding some meaning or quality to this very word. Since this very word is supposed to be noun, so this should be categorized or classified as adjective.